Welcome to Poem A Day with Ray, and this is our Day After Christmas poem by Terence Hayes. This book, American Sonnets for My Past and Future Assassin, was published in 2016 after the election, and it's a testament to racism in America and toxic masculinity and all these things that are still very much something that we're dealing with now, even though we're spending most of our time in our homes. This book is phenomenal, and I'm going to read you the very first poem in it. All the poem titles in this book are the same, even though the poems themselves are different, and they are all 14 lines like a sonnet, um, but they don't follow some of the other parameters that a sonnet would. American Sonnet for My Past and Future Assassin The black poet would love to say his century began with Hughes, or God forbid, Wheatley. But actually, it began with all the poetry weirdos and warriors and warriors, poetry whiners and winos, falling from ship bows, sunset bridges, and windows. In a second, I'll tell you how little writing rescues. My hunch is that Sylvia Plath was not especially fun company. A drama queen, thin-skinned and skittery, she thought her poems were ordinary. What do you call a visionary who does not recognize her vision? Orpheus was alone when he invented writing. His manic drawing became a kind of writing when he sent his beloved a sketch of an eye with an X struck through it. He meant, I am blind without you. She thought he meant, I never want to see you again. It is possible he meant that too.